Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. It's your buddy, the 14th Prime. I told y'all last week, as my son plays the piano, I told y'all last week they were going to reissue Fort Maximus. Here is your chance to get it. Um, I told y'all last week, last week in the video, I said Fort Max is being reissued. Well, now is the pre-order. So after you've watched these two ads, because I gave YouTube a couple years of my life, please, if y'all want it, it's 205 right now. He is awesome. Let me tell you, as a person who got it the like the first day it came out years ago, um, for, he is an awesome toy. He's not the G1 Fort Max that we got back in 1987, but it is kind of cool. There's a whole bunch of different fan modes that you can do with this guy. Cerebros does come off, and then Cerebros' head comes off to be, uh, um, oh, I can't think of his name, but it was Spike. Uh, but anyway, awesome toy. It has uh, lights. It has sound effects. It has transforming sounds when you put the head on. Um, as the owner of this toy and almost all the Titans, he is one of my favorites. But it's only because um, I had the original Fort Max and I can't get my hands on it, um, the G1 version. Now, the city mode lacks a little bit because you got the great big hands that still come out. Again, there are lots of fan modes where you can set this guy up in a couple other different ways. Me personally, I like to spread the leg straight out like he's doing a split and then turn at the knee and then flip out the uh, flip out from the shin down. And it makes it more like a bigger fortress. Um, the translucent plastic is quick to break. There's a little five millimeter port in there that supports a gun. Um, when after years and years of playing with it, that little gun on top, after years of playing with it, that plastic will crack. It won't break, but it will crack. Um, again, he's posable. He's huge. And I'm going to show you a comparison next to like my Omega Supreme in a couple minutes, but he is indeed an awesome robot to have. Um, one thing that they don't tell you, those knee guns come off. You can take the guns off of his knees, put them in his hands, and those two can become... Uh, two separate guns, but then you've just got these two blank kneecaps or knee two blank shins when you do that. He is a cool toy. My question is, why are y'all re-releasing this right now when like five, six years ago, seven, six years ago, this was in Ollie's for $25. I bought two of them when I saw them in Ollie's because I got them for uh, our nephews for Christmas. Turns out one of my nephews didn't even like Transformers, so I was like, I don't even think he should be in our family. Just kidding. Um, if you're watching. And so, but no, nah, I sold one of them on eBay. And I, I we gave the other one to, I don't, I, honestly, I don't even remember who we gave the other one to. But yeah, he didn't want it, so we just gave it to somebody for Christmas. We might have donated it to church or donated it to like uh, the poor kids at Christmas. Either way, here's your chance to get them again. $205. Seven years ago, it was 25 Years before that, it was, I think it was $199 when it originally released. He is awesome. He is huge. And now here is a side-by-side -side comparison of him with Omega Supreme in three, two. Never mind, just kidding. That's not the right picture. But Omega Supreme is to his left. It's about to, it's the next picture that's about to come. But you see, he is, he is tall. He stands in at like 25 inches. Um, and there you go. He, Omega Supreme is a lot shorter, but he's a lot, mm, like, heavier, if that makes sense. Because Fort Max, those legs are hollow. The arms are hollow. He has a whole lot of retooling from Metroplex. Now, he's not like my other Titans. My, my f three favorites are right there. Um, my Predaking, Scorponok, and the Ark. My favorite Titan of all that I own, Trypticon. I have G1 and the regular, but that city mode is the greatest city you'll ever have. As of right now, though, this girl right here has my heart. It's your buddy the 14th Prime. Y'all have a good afternoon. I'll try not to make another video.